ladies and gentlemen, Miss Rosa Parks. Good evening. I must admit, I am still a little apprehensive about speaking uh, in front of large groups of people. Reverend King has said to me, Mrs. Parks, just relax. The people have come to hear what you have to say, so just speak from your heart. I told him I would do just that. Rosa Parks went home to be with her Lord on October 24, 2005. More than 4,000 mourners gathered at Greater Grace Temple in Detroit, Michigan. The service lasted more than three hours. Her coffin was brought from Detroit, Michigan, to Montgomery, Alabama, to Washington, D.C., where she became the first woman and second African American to lie in state in the U.S. Capitol Rotunda. On Monday, December 5, 1955, Rosa Parks was found guilty of violating the segregation laws.